Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at cattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a pot full of cacti. I take two fingers on the left and I put a dot and two fingers on the right and put another dot. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a straight line down, curve at the bottom. Come up to the right hand side, straight line down, curve to the bottom and connect. Coming down over here on the left hand side, I'm just going to add one more curved line up, connect to the bottom, and now I come up to the top, starting on the left, and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down, up, connect on the right. Now, starting over here on the left, I'm going to go zigzag, 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 zig. I'm going to come down again, zigzag, 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 zigzag. I'm going to do one more, zigzag, 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 zigzag. Okay, starting on the left hand side, I'm going to draw a straight line up, curve line over, straight line down. These are going to be overlaps. And right over here on this side of the left, I'm just going to draw a curve line down, connect. Right next to it, I'm going to draw a curve line, straight line down, connect. Come up, straight line, curve line, straight line down, connect. Big straight line up, curve line down, straight line, connect. Now I'm going to do one behind it, straight line up, curve line down, straight line connect, and one curve line, straight line down, connect. These are all my cacti. Now I'm going to just put some dots. This is where the spines go. Not a lot, but a couple of lines in each one of my cacti. More than one is cacti just to give some decorative dots all the way across over here on the end and then I'm going to start over here on the left and I'm going to go curve line out in out in out in connect and I'm going to come up over here and draw a curve line out in out in connect and one more over here curve line out in out in connect now I'm going to draw some spines and they can go anywhere but I'm just going to go one, two, three straight lines. Come in the middle, one, two, three, four, five straight lines. Maybe one up here, one, two, three. And over here, one, two, three, four, five. Doesn't matter where you put them, just make sure you put some of them. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I did was I went and got all the greens I could find in my crayon box. I never throw anything away. And I'm going to color kind of with a pattern. First I'll use my first green, then I'll come over and use a different green. These are all light greens, yellow greens. Then I'll do my third green all the way across my cacti. Then, once I've done that, I come in with my green green and I just draw some straight lines over the colors that I've already done of all my other light greens. Okay? Now, my little flower tops, I'm going to do pink. So these should all be pink, these little flower tops. And I'm going to come down and do my pot. So I'm going to do different colors, browns, peaches. Keep going. You can use any colors you want, but I kind of wanted it to look a little southwest. So I went through and got all my tans, my beiges, every brown that I could think of. And I'm going to end my top with black. Just for a pop, 
of color. Okay, let's see what this pot full of cacti looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my pot of cacti all colored in, ready to go on somebody's porch or maybe next to a Pueblo. Okay, bye-bye.